Okay, we've got a Ford Fiesta in today, 2009. So we're just going to show you what we've found so far. And um, so concentrating on the back of the car, and um, we've got these welded seams up here by the gutter strip. If we look very closely, we can see that there's a crack there. So my colleague's just going to put some water up there, and we should have some water coming dripping out of here. So if you want to put some water up there, then, mate. Lovely. So we pour some water on there without it actually going inside the car. And then what it should then simulate. There we go. So we can see the water is dripping straight out, straight onto my fingers. So we've got the water here. And then what we're going to do is we're going to test the rear air vents behind the rear bumper. Um, so we're just going to quickly turn our hose on. Um, what I've got down here is I've got my twisty camera. And so if I just quickly get this twisty camera in place, um, it's probably going to be better going now. Okay. So this is your rear air vent, which is behind the rear bumper. Um, so when my colleague puts a bit of water up behind the rear bumper, simulating that obviously it's out in the rain, we should see water coming through the air vent. Okay, so it's coming in very slowly at that back corner there and, and as we can see obviously it all looks wet and just to show you as well up the back here If I can just get our camera there We have blanking tape and the blanking tape has come off and as we can see there is water making its way past the blanking tape and then working its way down um, it's doing that on both sides, uh, it doesn't seem to be leaking on the air vent on the passenger side but it is on the driver's side um, and then obviously what's then happening is obviously we're getting water in the boot and obviously the water was filling up in the spare wheel holder and um, the customer has took the water out of the boot um, so obviously it's not that bad and as we can see here this is where obviously it's starting to collect on the driver's rear um, so I believe we've found everything we've found so far um, with the top welded seams we would guarantee doing both sides um, and the same with the rear air vents as well.